Hi, my name is Brian Norton with the InData project at Easter Seals Crossroads. And today we're going to take a look at the Track Pro 2, which is a head mouse. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look. Hi, I'm Mary Sag, sitter from AbleNet. And I want to talk to you today about a new product called Tracker Pro 2. It actually allows an individual to use their head movement to go ahead and run either their iPad or their computer. Right now I'm just going to be talking about the iPad. Um, when we think about this particular product, we really want to take a look at individuals that might not have motoric movement of their hands to reach out and touch that iPad. Also, it is a product that is about head movement. It's not about eye control. It is about being able to functionally move your head from left to right and up and down. We'll be using these glasses, but the product itself requires the, a camera to see this metallic dot, whether it's on glasses or it's on your face. So I'm going to put the glasses on, and what you're going to notice is that there's a camera. This is the, talk, the Track Pro up here, too, because it is new. We've worked on our um, new camera and then also a new design. But you'll notice that across the screen, as I move my head left, right, up, down, I can move the cursor. Now, really, this is a new functionality on um, access to the iPad, which is basically gaining access to either iPads or Android through the use of the not only the Tracker Pro, but also within the iPad itself, you have to use the assistive touch. So I'm going to move this over, and I can dwell, basically rest on the camera. I've opened that up, as you see, and then if I go to take a picture, I have to go to the exact spot with my head. <laughs> Not always as easy as one might think. There we go. And I've taken a picture, and I'll show you that. I was just able to open the picture up, and you can see that that is actually the picture because it comes back into the frame that we're used to seeing once we take a picture. So it's really about being able to have this dot being recognized by the Tracker Pro and really gaining you full access to the iPad. So that's your tech tip for this week. My name is Brian Norton with the InData Project at Easter Seals Crossroads.